Oh, well, there's a lot of wires hanging off of that. That's mainly because I got the Firefly camera attached. Hey folks, Sky Pilot here, how you going? Yep, finally the sun has come out and the wind has died off, so I'm going to have my maiden flight of the e Chine X220. This is version 2 of the 220. Um, version 1 was a couple of years ago now. I've done a full review, unboxing, setup, etc. of this quad already, so check it out on the screen up there. I'm going to dive straight into a flight now and have a maiden fly and see how it goes. This thing is built like an outback dunny, so um, I'm not really too fussed if I crash it as long as I don't damage my camera. <laughs> Apparently this is set up for a beginner's unit and I've seen many people have some mishaps with it without anything breaking. Uh, she's fairly heavy. I've got a 1500 for us on top there. And like I said, I've got the Firefly X Lite HD camera at the front. I will have the steady shot flowing on that, so hopefully it's the right angle. It does fit in the mount that you get from eShine in the box there. As you can see, I've just stuffed some padding behind it with some patented rubber bands to hold it in. I've also attached my ND filter to the front of the Firefly, so it'll be interesting to see how that picture looks too. I haven't run that before as today's fairly bright and it's optimum. It's certainly a good condition to put that ND filter on. That's enough chit chat. No GPS on this. No onboard recording. It's just plug, play. Let's get her up. See how long that 1500 lasts for. It's fully charged and let's see how that VTX works and what the flight experience is exactly like. Links down below, thumbs up. Great to see you. Stick around. Let's go. Okay, make sure everything's recording. The Firefly, I believe, is recording. <laughs> Just need to find some signal. I hope I've got the fox here on the... Oh, I hope the fox here is on the correct angle for my recording. I couldn't really adjust it, it's really where the actual um, GoPro mount is situated from factory. So this is a beginner's quad guys. So. Hopefully I should be able to fly this around fairly well. Just have a cruise around first, get the feel of it. See what the tune's like, get a bit of noise going. Uh, milliwatt VTX as well which should be pretty good for some distance I'm just gonna fly it around here not doing anything crazy she feels really nice folks feels really nice So look, if you are in the market for a beginner quad, I don't think you can go too wrong with this one. Really well priced, and like I said, you get a few goodies with it. I have seen a few <laughs> rolls and tumbles uh, on YouTube where things haven't gone all that to plan but um, this seems pretty good let's go for a rise nice sunny day you very interested to see how that ND filter performs on top of my Firefly
And they call this a beginner quad because spare parts are really cheap, guys, should you happen to crash it. But like I said before, um, yeah, parts of this are all over the place so you won't have any troubles. And the other thing is, this thing is super strong. Really, really well set up to handle beginners and novices alike, absolutely. Really nice tune on this, guys. A really uh, easy tune to fly. I'm just cruising around here. I'm not doing anything crazy. Just having a fly around. Let's just go for a little bit of a climb up here. See how far we can go with that BTX. I'm thinking it's a fair bit of interference between me and there, so anywhere past this car park I'm at now is really good. Hey, that's decent. It is very decent. It's not even starting to break up. Yeah, that's good. That's yeah, that's more than acceptable. I have flown here before and I get a lot of break up up the top here but I don't actually have any at the moment a little fox ear lollipop on the back there is well suited alright try and save a bit of power to do a little bit of line of sight before we finish off Try a little bit of slow flying. Anybody can race around at a million miles now. Oh, we're getting low on power. Okay. Let's quickly take it down and finish off with a bit of line of sight. What do you think guys? Um, yeah, it flies really well. I'm really impressed. I hope I've captured some footage with that Firefly. I hope it's set up right. I haven't used it for a little while. Nice quad. Oh, really heavy too. <laughs> flies really well guys. Super steady. I'll be really interested to see how that footage came out um, really really nice experience yeah it is on the weighty side I was a bit skeptical I wasn't sure how nimble it would be but uh, the, yeah the 1500 under 10 minutes of flight time I was pretty cautious I was really impressed with how far it went uh, normally I don't get that far uh, with a 600 milliwatt sitting where I'm here because there's a heck of a lot of trees and it's up over the hill so that performed really well um, yeah the right hand circular lollipop on the back there uh, did a really good job let us know what you think guys do you want one have you got one nice little entry unit quad guys links down below drop us a comment say good day i'll see you next time bye for now